then we just go up another three miles. Mm -hmm. This is Rossi Avery, everyone, in blue. Um, what time do you want everybody to be? Trying to? Trying to. Just uh, something and be sure you say thank you. Oh, I mean, yeah, I could do one too. Well, maybe, yeah, both of you can ride on the same one. What the heck? Okay. Oh. You're both union organizers. Yeah. <laughs> Well, um, I don't know exactly where the legislation is. I think it's probably in judiciary. And um, you, you might know about when it might be coming up for hearing. Have you heard? Summer. They're saying summer. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think we'd be okay with it in the House. I, I can't predict the Senate. Um, we we got a little bit more work to do over there because it's going to take 60 votes for just about everything, yes. I think. Mm -hmm. And we do have one other U.S. Senator waiting in the wings. He um, has been declared elected by the elections uh, uh, board, but both the governor and the Secretary of State are Republicans, so they're just letting it hang out there. Mm -hmm. You know, we just came from an administration whose goal was to do away with unions, period. Right. Mm -hmm. And um, the, he didn't succeed on that, but the, it's deeply rooted in the mentality on the uh, Republican side, and they really um, uh, feel that the unions have too much power and yeah. they need to stop them and, you know, that sort of thing. So uh, it, they'll have every kind of right to work argument you can think of that they put out there and talk about on the floor. But um, we will um, be fairly certain of what votes we have before it goes to the floor. So, and, and once you uh, make a decision on, on those uh, votes, uh, they, they'll be there. <laughs> 